بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم الحمدللہ رب العالمین وصل اللہ وسلم علی نبی محمد وعلى آلہ وصحبہ وسلم اما بعد So what happens if someone is old or someone is sick and it's difficult for them to fast? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the Quran, وَعَلَى الَّذِينَ يُطِيقُونَ فِدْيَةٌ تَعَامٌ مِسْكِينَ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Al-Baqarah that those people who are able to that they should pay as a sort of expiation uh, they should feed the, the miskeen if they're, if they're unable to fast. وَعَنْ إِبْنَ عَبَّاسٍ رَضِيَ اللَّهُ تَلَ عَنْهُمَا قَالْ رُخِسَ لِلْشَيْخْ كَبِيرٍ وَعُجُوزٍ كَبِيرًا فِي ذَلِكَ وَهُمَا يُطِيقَانِ الصَّوْمِ أَنْ يَفْتَرَ إِنْ شَعَى أو يتعم كل يوم مسكين ولا قضاء عليهما ثم نسخ ذلك في هذه الآية فمن شهد منكم الشهر في اليوم وثابت للشيخ كبير والعجوز كبيرة إذا كانت لا يتيقان الصوم وحبل والمرض والمرضع إذا خافت افترتا وَأَتْعَمَتَا كُلُّ يَوْمْ مِسْكِينًا Ibn Abbas رضي الله تعالى عنه he said in regards to the ayah we just mentioned he said it was made permissible for the elderly man and the elderly woman in that ayah meaning to break their fast and if they are both وَهُمَا يُتِقَانَ صَوْمْ أَنْ يَفْتَرَ إِنْ شَعْ So meaning that if they're able to fast, even due to their elderliness, and they are elderly, that they, are, they have the choice. That they can, if they're able to, they can either fast or break their fast, if they will. Or, if they break their fast, then they can feed for every day they broke their fast uh, one poor person and they do not have to make up their fast then he said anhu, he said then this ayat then this was abrogated by the ayat where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says فَمَنْ شَاهِدَ مِنْكُمْ الشَّهَرْ فَلْيَصُومْ that whoever witnesses this month, meaning the month of Ramadan, then they should fast. وَثَابَتَ لِشَيْخْ كَبِيرٍ وَعَجُوزَ كَبِيرًا إِذَا كَانَتَ لَا يُتِيقَانِيَ الصَّوْمِ وَحُبْلَ وَمَرْضِعِ إِذَا خَافَتَا إِفْتَرَتَا وَأَتْعَمَتَا كُلُّ يَوْمٍ مِسْكِينَ So he said that that ayat, the ayat we just mentioned, that whoever witnesses the month of Ramadan that they should fast, that in regards to that, that it has been affirmed for the elderly person, the elderly man or elderly woman, that if they are, if they are unable to fast during the month of the Ramadan, so if someone who's elderly, they're unable to fast during the holy month of Ramadan, or if someone is pregnant, a woman is pregnant and she's fearful that by fasting it's going to harm her, or it's going to harm her unborn uh, child, or the woman who breastfeeds, she fears that she won't be able to give enough milk to her child, or that it's going to be harmful for the child, then they can break their fast. And for each day that they break their fast, they should feed a poor person. So this is the hukum regarding the person who is uh, an elderly person or a, uh, a woman who's pregnant or a woman who breastfeeds who is fearful that they're unable to fast 
then they can break their fast. And for every day they break their fast, they should uh, feed someone who is poor. And as far as the amount of what they should feed, we'll, we'll get to that in another daughters. We'll, we'll talk a little more extensively about it. But that's the general ruling. And we ask Allah the Almighty to accept our good and forgive our evil. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala Nabi Muhammad.